very disappointing loss for our players and our team. Uh, I think we had them for 39 minutes and 30 seconds, and uh, got to give them some credit. You know, 33 came up with two big threes in a row on us. 24 hit the last one at the end of the game to put them ahead. You know, we had a player, Gabby Labor, came back and hit the three to tie it for us, and you know, they just they just weren't to be uh, uh, beat. And uh, but like I said, I was extremely proud of the way our players played. We lost Miranda here, three men of mark left to go in the game. That was a huge factor in the ball game because now we lost our inside presence and had to put in a guard in her spot and, and uh, hurt us on the board and some of those other things. So uh, that hurt. Very proud of the way we rebounded. You know, this team's been beating everybody on the boards by 14 or 15 a game, and we all rebounded them by 18. Uh, you know, the, and you know, again, give them some credit. They're 29 for 30 from the free throw line. You don't find very many teams that shoot that well from the free throw line, not in men's or women's basketball. And they had to to win the game fairly. Uh, so, like I said, I'm very proud of our players. Uh, these two in particular, good news is we've got them back for another year. Um, and, uh, you know, we just had a, haven't had any rabbits feet down here in the first round against the Poria last year. It was the same kind of a game. Came down to the last minute. They get a shot with 45 seconds left, and we threw the ball away. And, and uh, obviously, turnovers hurt us in the game. Their quickness and their athletic ability had something to do with those turnovers. And if we don't probably have 22 turnovers, we win the game uh, probably fairly easily. But we did. And uh, again, credit goes to Corey. Rebounding, we've been we've been a strong rebounding team all year. We've been a good defensive team all year. Um, so that's something we expect to do. We knew we really had to step it up against these people the way they crushed everybody on rebounds and offensive rebounds uh, in the conference tournament they had. Um, but we you know we match up pretty well. Jill's a little bit bigger than their four, and Miranda is just as big, if not taller, than their five. And it, it's just a question of we had to get our perimeter kids to get some rebounds. I thought we did that pretty good for about the first 30 minutes and the last 10, that kind of got away from us a little bit. And they started getting some offensive boards underneath and getting to the foul line when we had to foul them, uh, in, you know, as far as putbacks are concerned. But, uh, you know, in our league up there, um, a lot different than this league in the fact that a lot of teams up there play with your typical five and your typical four type players where almost all these MIAA teams are on the dribble drive, which they almost all do, depend on fours that step out at the three-point line and dribble and things like that. But at the same point in time, they're probably not great at whole block defense and, and posting up. And uh, so that's what we tried to take advantage of.
that situation, just like 33 is there for, and get those two threes at the end of the game against us. So, uh, you know, but, but that's the reason.